Y'all, it's cold in the mug. <laughs> oh, we is cold. It's cold as hell. Mm-mm. Anyway. Ooh, I can't get my thoughts together. It's so cold. Oh my God. Lord. Anywho, y'all, happy Sunday. I am sitting in the car waiting for it to warm up a little bit more. Um on my way to uh Burlington because I need to pick up some more kitchen mats. My um kitchen mats are pretty faded. It's time for them babies to go. We've had them for about six years now. So, yeah, it's time to let go. So, so I'm on my way, too, real quick. And I'm also uh, grabbing the kids um, some jeans because I'm we're doing, like, a, a family photo shoot. Well, we're doing a, a photo shoot with the kids. Me and King is not going to be in it because um, our hair is not where it needs to be. So, we're just going to do a photo shoot with, for the, with the kids only. So I need to pick up um, a couple of pairs of jeans for, I need a pair for Bud and for Mariah. And I haven't decided on the top, the color or whatever. Oh, and MJ. Almost forgot about my baby. So yeah, I got to pick those up. And then coming back home and set everything up. And then we're going to chill because today is my baby. Today is my baby uh, birthday today. Um, King doesn't celebrate his like birthday. Like he doesn't do like a party or anything like that. But today is his Earth Day, um, the day that the Most High allowed him to enter into this world. So yeah, he turned 35 today. I'm just thankful that the Most High allowed him to see um, today and allow him to breathe. Um, a new a new in a new day of breath of fresh air so yeah that's what i'm doing right now I'm just sitting here waiting for this truck to finish warming up but i also wanted to come on here and give y'all an update on what went down with the dentist because i know i didn't include that <laughs> in the other video but y'all i just didn't want that video to be super super long so i'm coming on here now to let y'all know you know, it was a little, little iffy or whatever. Um, but they got your girl together. They did, they did. King got needs some work. He needs some work. That's all I can say. King needs some work. Um, me on the be on the other hand, I have to go back in this Thursday coming because I gotta get two crowns and I have some other stuff that's going on in the back of my mouth. I have a couple of holes in my wisdom teeth. But they're not bothering me, luckily. Um, but I got to go back and get some work done. Um, the doctor, well, not the doctor, the dentist told me from the feeling that I got from the last dentist that I went to, y'all, she, she jacked my mouth up. Plain and simple. She jacked my mouth up. And long story short, they're going to put crowns on both sides to go ahead and correct what she messed up when i left when i went to the last dentist and she was numbing me because after i had a mirror i ended up catching cavities or whatever my eating habits was not good with that with that pregnancy with a mirror so i ended up having cavities or whatever and at the time i had six so she was doing some fill-ins and I kept feeling the pain and I kept telling her like you know I kept making it known that I was in pain and she numbed me about four times and I still felt every bit of pain like y'all it was not good and when I left up out of there it I was jacked up my mouth was jacked up so uh, from there I you know I was like you know what I'm not going back I gotta find me somebody else because going to the dentist is supposed to be a calm experience you're supposed to be relaxed and you're not supposed to be in excruciating pain, like not while you're getting stuff done, especially if they didn't numb you. So I was having a lot of issues going on um, with that dentist. And I was like, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna find me somebody else and hopefully 
you know, I'll be all right. But even even with that, I was still on the fence because that pain that I was feeling was not okay. So um, I did let this dentist know, you know, I, I did let, I was very upfront. Um, and I, I told him, you know, I didn't, I wasn't comfortable. She made me uncomfortable. Even after I told her that I was in pain, you know, she was like, are you sure you really in pain or are you just, you know, cause you can hear the drill. And I'm like, girl, like I know when I'm in pain. So long story short from that, um, I did tell this dentist my experience with that dentist and, you know, rest assured they went ahead and got me together, cleaned my teeth or whatever and said that, you know, we're gonna start with the two crowns. So hopefully tomorrow they supposed to call me and let me know after they check King's insurance because I'm on his dental insurance as a backup. Hopefully that'll go ahead and knock what I'm about to pay on this upcoming Thursday. That'll knock that balance down. If not, then I'm about to be paying $500. Yeah, $500. For two crowns but I need them, you know what I'm saying? So I can't keep putting this off. It's already been a year because with the pandemic, everything was shut down. And, you know, when I uh, called myself trying to, you know, get back into the dentist, a lot of people were booked because everybody was pretty much shut down for a, a long time. So yeah, getting that work done. Um, I don't, you know, I don't know how that's going. I don't know. I never had crowns before. Um, I, I don't know, but I'm getting it done, and that's all. That's that's all that matters. So, yeah, it's pretty much that. But, whoo, y'all, it's cold. The car has warmed up, but it's cold. I got my big winter coat on. So if you here in Michigan, baby, don't go out there trying to be cute. Mm -mm. This ain't the weather to try to be cute with them little thin little coats and whatever. You need to be wrapping yourself up because it's cold out here. And baby, <laughs> my fingers is aching, okay? But anywho, I'm about to go ahead and get off of here because I feel myself about to start rambling. And when I get back, we can chop it up with King and probably show y'all this little photo shoot. All right, y'all.